Hey everybody, I like seeing the Detroit Tiger head over on the right. We're playing another game. I'm sure you figured that out if you clicked on this video. <laughs> um, Battle of the Bay, some interleague play coming up. Now from a place that's seen its share of great now, moments through the years, a look at the Oakland Coliseum. Tonight, the first of this quick two-game series between the San Francisco Giants and the Oakland A's. It's ace baseball, and it comes your way next. Great thing about this is it's a very short commute for our team to go to a game. Also, since Tug Dick is trying to beat Ricky Henderson's record, what better place to be playing? Out of Tennessee will be the starting pitcher. Harold, any thoughts? Well, Matt, I'm curious about what's in the tank for him. Last no, your thought should be, is the Fester ever going to catch Tweety Bird? And the answer is no. But back -to -back stars, Tug Dick, 385. We'll see he yeah, what was it, 83 stolen bases? Tug Dick. Top of the first two outs. Takes this the other way to right. And he oh, my God, he was robbed. Solid contact, but robbed by the right fielder. Look at that. Screw you, sir. Look how grumpy or angry or serious is. I'll get them balls. Out of context, that sounds odd. Damn you, Lloyd. You screwed us last time. Let's see if we can screw you now. Not in a sexy way. Come on, Tug Dick. Don't let him get that. Whoa, what the hell? And he will get make the running play and that will end the inning all right that was a little difficult to control but it worked out tied ball game after three tug dick oh for one riding in once again hey where's your guys' elephant top of the fourth line come on drop again Yes! And that's a I was afraid we were going to be like, okay, let's hit the right fielder, center and left, let everyone get a catch. Well, you make in-game adjustments, right, Matt? I mean, they've had a hard time scoring. Right here, he jumps on the first pitch to get things going, so I see a little bit of a change. Maybe this is how they jumpstart their offense for the rest of the game. Oh, Brandon Moss coming up. One for one. One for one as he reached base with a double his first time up. Obviously, you can tell the excitement in my voice at having Brandon Moss First come to the plate. At bat on its way. Takes a knee-high fastball. Well, if you love pitching and defense, this has been a game for you. Are you happy with that, Dan? I think this continues for a while, Matt. Both of these pitchers are throwing very well, throwing strikes, having good command of their off-speed pitches. This is going to be one of those low-scoring affairs. Who's having an affair? Oh, get a room. Swing and a miss, and he's in control. 0 and 2. Ah, quickly down two strikes. That's the Brandon Moss we know and Tug Dick hates. If we see one at all, it'll pop out of the zone. Fuck it, we're going, man. That was easy. That guy took all day to throw that thing to home. We all know this team is struggling right now. They're there we go. Feels good so to get that steal in this ballpark. To be a little bit more aggressive and try to put some pressure on your opponents. Stolen bases are a good way of doing that. So we'll see if it pays off on the scoreboard for him right now. Now a spin and a throwback. Now that's where Boshi might say it's a bad thing to go for third, but he can no suck some dicks. I have no, no faith in Brandon Moss. To this point. Runner goes for third. Yeah. Yes, he got beans. We may not have got third. But at least wow, Moss isn't at the plate anymore. About it. He almost hits him with the previous pitch, and then he actually does it with the next one. Going to be interesting to see if they seek revenge at some point. I hope they don't. Don't be beating and tug Dick when he's at the plate. It's not his fault what happened. Here's Buster Posey. Come on, Moss. You can get a steal. There we go. Double steal. And it skips in as he steals the bag easily. Brandon Moss. Technically, like, Moss, I can teach you how to be a winner. This is how you steal. Now we got runners on second and third. That was a horrible throw to the third baseman. Or at least a horrible job of him trying to catch it. The 
0 1 pitch. And this ball is heading for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0 and 2. Ah, just don't hit it backwards. A they have a ton of follow here territory here down. in the stadium. Now a ball line softly down the oh, right ho, ho. Line, if that had only been ball. fair. Set to deliver on nothing in two. Here it comes. Chop foul over towards the coaching box. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Oh, no. strikes him out. As he swings through it for the first out of the Sorry, right, Posey. You can't win them all. Fight on that slider right there. The best ones have that late action that just starts at the last minute. They're so tough to get the bat on. And when you've got that good slider going. It's yeah, it was a, a pretty solid up. pitch. Brandon Belt. He's been huge this year. First baseman Brandon Belt as the first pitch to him is a changeup that can't find the zone. It's ball one. We'll see if he can deliver here. Look at that. He's got his average back up to 297. 69 RBIs. It'd be nice to get 70 and 71 right here. Whee! Here it comes, 1 0. Oh. Dribbled to the right side. gets foul. If that was fair, they still could have brought in a run. Tug Dick would have gone because there's only one out. And he comes back with a fastball, one and two now. Boy, I love the way he's competing out there on the mound right now. He's got a chance to rack back-to-back -back K's with two runners. In I would not position. like that. He's not giving in at all. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. We, we've been bad the last three games about leaving guys stranded. It's time to put that behind us. He's set. Here's the 2 2. Lifted in the air to straight away. That might be enough to bring in a run. So Dick's going to try it. Two gone. You're never going to catch me, son. Good job by Brandon Belt. To an early one nothing lead. Hey, this has pretty much been a pitcher's duel so far, so. Any way you can score a run in a sack fly right there brings home the first run of the game here in the middle innings. Tug Dick, one for two. If we still have the lead, it's partly because of him. Hopefully we still do. We do, one zero. Top of the six. First offering on its way. Hard on the ground. Ooh, nice hit. Try into the hole that He's getting all the in outfielders bottom. involved. He's hit it to right, center, Another and left. Hit. Another multi-hit game. He has been on some kind of hot streak. They better start paying attention to him. He's the true athletic. How you feel about that, Oakland? Stepping in now. Boo. <laughs> And a pitch out, nothing doing though. I remember That's last season, Brandon Moss was horrible. And the craziest thing is, when because Tug Dick hits ahead of him, Brandon Moss gets a lot of free balls like that. There's a lot of pitch outs where he gets a situation where, you know, it's a it's a free ball. So he gets into hitter counts and he still fails a lot. Over to first, and he'll dive back in safely. One run, four hits, and no errors on the giant ledger to the... Uh, I might have been a little second. late. A pitch out. The throw. And even a pitch out can't do this. Oh, that was close. I got quiet because I'm like watching the up. What is it? What is it? Um? Pitched out and the throw was pretty good, but they still couldn't cut him down. Look at that. Two pitch outs in a row. They're so scared of him. Like that gives Moss a great hitter's count right there. 2-0. And he didn't have to do anything to earn it. Runners on his way to third. Pitches We're pushing it. Throw. Oh, thank God. That was not a good throw. That was a good throw. We would have been fucked. I want Ricky Henderson's record, says the dick. That he has no faith in Brandon Moss. Tug Dick already has more steals this year than he did all last year. Yeah, but for him, Matt, he's more pitch to contact kind of guy. And obviously, it's working so far. And the way he oh, thank God he didn't swing on that. Pitch count down. One out Full one count. Third. 
And he misses with one here. Oh, they actually walked him, thank God. At least bring the double play. Thank Grobnar the baseball god. Oh, we needed that. And what first base opened, the last thing he wanted to do was give him something to hit in the heart of the zone. So no harm done. Yeah, and Buster Posey come to the plate. One for two today, hitting 332. The only one with a better average on the team is Tug Dick. two trips to the plate thus far. And we see some action in the A's bullpen now. Or unders at the corners. And a righty that start to loosen up. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Sends that one out of play for strike one. With one out and runners. Bocha, you always look so serious. You always look grumpy. But it can help you stay out of the double play if it's well executed. Maybe your Mac is duck, uh, duck, tug, duck, quack. Um, Tug Dick always complains about your lineups when Moss is in it. I don't know. Swing, but he holds up in time. Ball one. Good check swing on that off-speed pitch. Clearly, he's sitting fastball, ready to let it fly. He recognized it was an off-speed pitch and was able to hold up. Tug Dick is ready. Look at that. He's ready to get home. Oh, he jumped the gun a bit on that swing, and he's down one and two. With two strikes and the runners at the corners, this is a big pitch coming up. Got to execute to hope to either get a strikeout or a double play ball to help you get out of this thing. And a good take there. Close. Yeah, it's two, two, two count. Well, I'll tell you, he's not hitting over 300 by luck. He really knows the strike zone and his own strengths. That is that true. There's no one else I'd rather have at the plate right now than Buster Posey. He'd be the best person on the team to draw, walk, or just get a clutch hit. And now a slider in there. I say that and he strikes out. He did not like that call though. You can tell he's talking to the um. There's really no other way to say it. Not a lot of good scoring Brandon Belt though coming up to the plate. Right now, it's just been an uphill battle for them to make anything positive happen. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Well, first base, Brandon Belt. We'll nine. see if he can come through in a clutch Brandon spot here. Two Belt. on, two out. It would be nice to get six. more than a one-run lead. Looking to keep this a one-run game. The pitch. Ball one. Oh, I bet Moss is playing. Oh, Moss is probably playing because he's one of them is playing in the DH spot. Ground ball right side. Oh, you're not gonna make it. Damn it, we got nothing out of that. That sucks. Giants leave a couple. They lead it one. Ah, we still have a one run lead. We gotta hold on to that though. Hold on to it like a loved one. Make gentle love to it. So Dick two for three. He's two for three thus far. Top of the eight, still a one run lead. Pitch on the way. Ooh, right up the middle. There we go. What is that? Three for four? He's got his third hit of the game. So he picks on the first pitch here and is able to extend the inning. Matt, that's his third hit of the night, his third single. I'm sure he'd like to have a double or something mixed in, but for now, he'll take He doesn't need a double. In fact, singles are even better if he's going for the steel lead. Now in the Oakland pen. Now a throw over to first. A dive, but he's back. Come on, Brandon Moss. Do something. Last at bat, you ended up with a 2-0 count having and done nothing, and you still crapped the bat. Well, I think you got hit in. then. Box now. Brandon Moss lifted the other way to left center. Gentry giving chase. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Well, that was a whole lot of nothing. Not too many more shots left. Home half of the eighth coming. Uh, one and a half innings to go. We only got that narrow one run lead. Once again, Lloyd James, fourth trip to the plate now, and he's hitless to this point. Yeah, he and his teammates have We need six outs to end this thing. Obviously, we can't get them all in the inning unless we cheat somehow. Here's a swing and a ball hit. Come on, Tug Dick, get there, get there. Oh, no. And that's into the gap and should be extra bases. And Good job, Jay, backing him up. Bases, the tying runs aboard with a leadoff double. Man, that swing looked like self-defense than a real quality swing. But, hey, he muscled it out there, and it was enough to get him safely the second. Those are the kind of hits that will drive you nuts as a pitcher. 
We lost? Are you kidding me? We've lost like four games straight now. So they must have won in what, the bottom of the ninth there? Or maybe the eighth. Hammers down the save. That is so frustrating. So that's a wrap here tonight. So I think three for four. The next best guy on the team, Brandon Moss, one for three. So I had the majority of the hits for the team. I'm just shaking my head. He had a great game. The rest of the team did not, though. This is a four game series. It's still time to come back. Either way, we got to stop this losing streak. We've lost four straight. It's interleague baseball next on MLB Network. Sunny Gravy. Oh, I was hoping it was Sunny Gravy. Gravy's delicious. What do we need to know here, HR? Well, Maddie's got an ERA under four now. That's not great, and it's not bad either. He's consistent, and he's a very reliable pitcher. So the thing you like about him... You Runners on first and second, get no outs. You get what you get. Fouled back. Harold, these A's as they begin play here this afternoon. They've been playing some pretty good baseball of late as they've won six of their last eight games. Well, Matt, they're 2-2 two and two on the homestand, so obviously you don't want to go 2-3 and three if you lose this game here. 3-2, and two, though. The win today... Gets you shooting towards maybe a nice little winning streak. That's why this game. Yeah, we need a winning me. streak. We're in the middle of a losing streak. It Andy isn't so hot. That here. wasn't a hot Scott swing either. Powell. That's a nice pitch. A fastball in that jams him. And now you go back outside. You know he's got to protect inside. You go back outside to try to get the out. A ground ball to oh, no. That's not going to help us at all. It could have been worse, though. We did advance the runner to third. And we've set up a situation where Tug Dick can hopefully steal second. Working on the 88th so steal. In, Brandon Moss. And he's the right man for How do you have so many RBIs? Other than one time when you hit a home run, when we were on base, every time we've been on base, you have failed. And he has to dive, but he's back in easily. We're going to second if we can. On the stretch, here's the pitch. A pitch out. The throw. They pitched out and then decided not to throw to second? What the hell kind of play was that? I'm not going to complain. Who pitches out and then like, nah, I'm not, not going to get him. Fair enough. We'll take the steal. 2-0 pitch on the way. 3-0 now. Well, Please Matt, do not swing, Brendan Moss. Nice Let him walk you. Very good job driving in runs. Now in this game, you capitalize on it. You grow from your mistakes and be able to come back and deliver in this one here. Here comes the pitch to Moss. A changeup that just catches the bottom of the zone for a strike. Probably better that he let that pitch go anyway. Brandon, or uh, Buster Posey, I think, is on deck. It's Posey, come out here, hit him in the back of the head, knock him out, and take his spot. Up. I'll give you a Twinkie if you do. It's like, I'm going to prison. It's worth it. You make new friends. Full count. That's what the big fella's supposed to do. Let that go downtown. Let it all fly. He let the dog out right there. I want to see if he calms it down or does it again on this pitch. Ready now with the payoff pitch. Hold high in the and he right swung field. at it. Moving under Is he going to bring the run in, though? He makes the catch. He's going home. From third. Yes. And the Brandon Moss actually did his job. Got a run in. Good job, man. Lead. Got his job done there and made it look pretty simple. Got it into the outfield to bring home the first run of the game and pick up the RBI. Yeah, got Jay home. Buster Posey. Buster Posey in 330. He's carrying a rather substantial batting Buster average up in the 330s. Come on, we need more than one uh, run. Last inning, or last game, one run was not near enough. Down at the knees for a strike. Time for a look at our umpires in this one. Working the plate is Carl Dixon. Well, Matt, the interesting thing about Carl, look, pitchers struggle with balls in the corner. They don't like that he makes them throw the ball. 
Wait, I wanted to hear what the rest of you was going to say. I wanted to hear about what kind of ump it is. Sometimes it's worth paying attention to that commentary, but they cut it off because of the pitch. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. Now a swing and a ball popped high in the air. Ah, uh, that's that big fall ball. territory here in Oakland. So put this one away and the side is retired. Two hits for the Giants lead to a run in the inning. We'll move on to the bottom half of inning number one. The well, the important thing is we've got the lead. I want to build on that. Now batting, Brandon Phillips. Oh, he's not so good on the road, but luckily for him, he's great at home. Hitting 355 at home. Tied ball game. Oh, come on, Giants. <laughs> Runner in the second. Come on, Tug Dick, you got it. Dick Who the, the hell is that crazy lady trying to throw him off of the... the <laughs> I can't even do that. Mm. Doug Dick, 0 for 1. Tied ball game, top of the third. No outs. Begin things here against Sonny Gray. Good swing, just got to try and straighten that one out. A uh, little early, pulled that... The wind up and the 0 1. That misses wide. One ball and one strike. That's back to back breaking balls away, but now he's got himself into a little bit of a tough spot. You probably can't throw that again, so your yeah, you can. Is probably up there just looking for a fastball that he can drill. Oh, they have a uh, I shouldn't listen to you. I was looking for a fastball high. Did not work at all. Got him with a changeup way I'm outside. Change up again. Didn't look like he picked it up very well out of his hand. Weak chopper up the Come around. Don't even look for it. It's out of the park. Here he comes again. One, two. Oh, I don't think that's going to carry enough, though. Got under it too much. That's all right. Make the center fielder. Earn his paycheck. And with one away, we'll bring you a look at the current division standings, and you can see Seattle the way out on front. For them if they want to make noise in the division. Yeah, Oakland's going to have to go on a hell of a run here. There's still a lot of games left to go. We've only played a hundred and well, they've only played a hundred and seven. This would be 108, the one we're in right now. Tied ball game, bottom of the fourth. Will into the windup. Here comes the two-two pitch. Look at that, tug dick. Oh, come on, get under it, bro. <laughs> we don't need an error like the All-Star game. Ew, gross. Get the hell out of here, bro. Tug dick, 0 for 2. We got a runner on first, top of the fifth. Still a tied ball game. Here's the first pitch to him. Now a fastball, a bit too low here. It's ball one. I would love a home run. Tug Dick doesn't hit a lot of them. I don't even know if he's had double digi digits for home runs yet this year. Hard ground ball to third. Oh, yes, that works. I mean, obviously, that's not a home run, but I'll take a single. He's all about the small balls. I mean, small ball. <laughs> Ready uh, for Brandon another Moss. shot now, <laughs> Brandon Moss, and we'll see what he can do here with a pair of runners on base. And hey, a Rolling Stone guy, there's no Moss. That means nobody wants you, Moss. It's like, Dick, you're mean. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. Looked like he just tried to do too much with that fastball right there. He, he overthrew it a little bit. That's pretty much the case when you airmail a fastball like that. Ball and no strikes. Here it is. There's a knee-high pitch that catches the zone. Uh, one, one. Trying to hang a zero. Here's the pitch. Uh, one, two. Come on, Moss. For the love of God, don't strike out. Really be an effective pitch for a guy. Everybody who's been watching this over the years has seen you strike out more than enough. If you could, you probably we've probably seen him strike out more than we've seen Tug Dick strike out. Swing. And he strikes out. With two strikes, and that will retire That's got to be Bochi's butt, buddy, because why else would he be in the number four spot in the lineup? Two. Tied ball game. <sighs> Doug Dick, one for three. Hitting 390. We got a runner on first. Tied ball game. Top of the seventh. First offering on its way. Oh, way early on that. It looked beautiful and big right in the middle, but it was uh, 
Oh, is that a slider? Yeah. Ready with the 0-1. In the dirt Go to second. Here. And he'll Safe. make it into scoring position here with two away as that'll be scored a wild pitch. Most excellent. We need to get on now, though. We got a runner in scoring position. Nothing in two count and the pitch. And oh, I should not have swung at that. Tug Dick tried to do too much. It's like Brandon Moss taught me. Yeah, I don't think that's Moss's fault. And we lose again. We have lost five straight. Damn, what has happened to our team? Talk about rough. Guys are very important. He is Obviously worthy of the nose. Pedro North, nose worthy. He had a good game. Factor, of course, and is the of Even though he only pitched four innings. Well, it's not that often, well everybody, that's it for me. Our team has got to turn it around. You know, actually, let's go to the clubhouse a second and see what the standings are. So Dick, one for four, which isn't bad, honestly. You know, he got on on a fielder's choice. He did get a single. You know, you're not going to hit 400 every game. Or even 300. We have got to stop this losing skid, though. And it's frustrating when you're playing well. And the team is not. We are three games up on the Diamondbacks. Thank God. Kind of ridiculous we're on top of anybody at this point. Uh, cards three games up on the Reds. Cards now have the most wins in the National League. Braves two games up on the Mets. Mariners three games up on the Rangers. The Tigers half a game up on the White Sox. Yes, they're coming around. Look at that. Their team is not any good except for when it comes to pitching. Luckily, their pitching is fifth best. And the Rays 11 games up on both the Red Sox and the Yankees. I don't know, I'm shaking my head right now, because I don't know what else Tug Dick can do. He's been doing outstanding with this team, especially since Moss has been in. Look, we've lost the last five straight. Well, next time, two more games in Oakland, where we try and split the series and stop this losing streak. Thanks so much for hanging out and being a part of this.